Hey guys, I'm back. It's been a little minute just because of the holidays and everything. I didn't bring my camera with me when I went home to visit my family. So um, it's been a little minute, but I just wanted to say thanks to all my new subscribers. Um, I was checking my uh, analytics on my YouTube page. I think that's how you say it. And um, I got almost 300 new subscribers in the last month. In the last, I think 28 days it said. Which is crazy. I don't know where all these people are coming from. But I like really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy my videos. So um, as you can tell from the title. This is going to be a what I ate in a day plus a painting segment. Like I did way back like a while ago. I'll link the video somewhere here. And um... I just was having like a dilemma. I didn't know if I should make a vegan video or make an art video because I haven't made a lot of art videos and it's been a while since I've made one. And I just know that my vegan videos are more popular. Like most of my subscribers seem to be here for the vegan videos. So like I did before, I'm just gonna mesh them both together. So yeah, that's what this video is gonna be. And I already got a pretty late start in the day. I was, um, when I woke up, I had to do some things, run some errands, blah, blah, blah. So it's like noon and I'm just not eating breakfast. So I'm having a bowl of red grapes. They're pretty big. They're really good. I got them from Whole Foods. Um, yeah, so that's part of my breakfast. And then I'm just going to have a banana. And then I have some tea in my little mug with the A on it. It's really cute. I love this mug. I think it's from TJ Maxx. And, um... This is the tea I'm having. It's really good. Let's see if it'll focus for me today. Oh, oh, are you gonna focus? Oh, yay. <laughs> it's classic Indian spice. It's really good. This is my first time having it. Like, my first time buying it. I've been drinking it for like the past three days. It's super good. It's not caffeinated. It's just herbal tea. I love it. So I'm about to eat that now and then I'll probably start painting soon before um, I get hungry for lunch because this is a very light breakfast so I'm probably going to want to eat pretty soon. So yeah, that's my long intro and my breakfast. So I'll see you for painting and lunch. So it is lunchtime and I am feeling pretty lazy. Today is a lazy day. I didn't really have anything to do, no work, um, yeah, school. So uh, I'm not feeling that great because of lady problems, girl problems, TMI. So I'm just going to make something really easy for lunch and then most likely make something really easy for dinner too. So I'm going to make these. Um, vegan pot stickers that I got from Whole Foods and I really like pot stickers I haven't had this brand before I usually get the ones I eat from Publix but I went to Whole Foods to treat myself because Whole Foods is like heaven to me so I got these so I'm gonna make these and um, I got some cut okra also from Whole Foods I just love okra I know a lot of people think okra is like the weirdest vegetable, but I think it's so good. She ain't shit. She ain't shit. 
so I've been doing this new thing when I'm painting where I just go for it without really thinking about it like I don't plan out what I want to paint or I don't sketch it out like the stuff I usually do I usually like to sketch do a pretty good sketch of the painting before I put the paint down that's what I do with my oil paintings but lately I've been using acrylic just more for like a looser feel and just just to do whatever and sometimes it comes out good sometimes they come out looking kind of weird but it's just kind of like a practice for me and, and plus it's just relaxing and fun to not really think too hard about what the outcome needs to be so that's what I'm doing tonight I'm just going for it I just took like a quick picture on my phone and using that as just a little bit of reference but not really and I'm just using whatever colors I want so it's just this is just something that's fun for me and I would suggest that any other people or artists you know to do this every once in a while like I know some artists that do this once every day they just do a random painting or a random drawing and so this just gets you to just loosen up and have fun with some colors and do what you want and it doesn't have to come out looking perfect like I said before like sometimes I I wanted to show the people that follow my page for my art some of the stuff I have been working on recently just because like I said earlier I haven't really done any painting videos so I just want to show you guys some of my more recent stuff. I'm gonna make start making more time-lapse videos it's just to be completely honest like whenever I sit down and paint and I know I'm like recording myself it gives me like low-key anxiety like I feel like I need to paint faster so I don't use up a lot of space and then I'm like I hope it looks good it's just like it's weird pressure that I put on myself when I paint on camera so I don't really like doing it so if anyone has ideas for different kind of art videos like I can give tips like that one video where I showed my paint palette I, I'm open to doing stuff like that like I'll still do time-lapse videos but they probably won't be like that frequent just because I like to feel relaxed when I paint and recording myself just doesn't make me feel relaxed when I'm painting that is <clears throat> but yeah that's that that's some of the stuff I've been doing and then what I was just working on today I still got a long ways to go that's just like the first layer but it's fun she kind of looks like a turtle I don't know why I think that but yeah okay So it is dinner time and I want to make a grilled cheese with spicy mustard and french fries. So it's pretty self-explanatory, I'm sure everyone knows how to make a grilled cheese. The only thing is I have to use my shredded mozzarella because I had some diet um, cheddar, like the cheddar block, but little did I know it got moldy because I guess it's been in the fridge for a while. I only used it freaking once. So now I have to use these. Hopefully it'll still come out how I want. But it's usually good with the spicy mustard. And then just some vegan butter to toast the bread. This is um, prairie bread. Just has a lot of seeds, organic, whole foods. Um, got some olive oil for the pan and for the french fries. Got some pink Himalayan salt, some black pepper and lemon pepper that's like my new fave thing right now is to season french fries with lemon pepper and then i have these shoestring french fries from whole foods also no salt added so i'm pretty hungry and i just feel like one sandwich and fries aren't going to fill me up so i forgot i have these um uh Gardein crispy tender seven grain tenders in my freezer so i'm going to just pop two of these in the oven with the french fries and probably um toss them in some buffalo sauce after they're done. I feel like I never show y'all what I drink in a day on top of what I eat in a day. I drink a lot. Like, um, I try to drink 
two these days, 32 ounce mason glass or three. It just depends on like how thirsty I am because I noticed once I started drinking a lot of water and like um, tea, I was always craving like water and tea if I didn't have any. And um, I just, I drink herbal tea, no sweeteners, none of that, just straight out of the bag and that's it. So this is just a, a bag of peppermint tea and some hot water. And so I'm gonna drink this with my dinner. I'm about to drink some, like probably half now and then half while I'm eating. So I just wanna show you guys that because drinking water and I'm a big lover of herbal teas, so that's important too. So the sandwich is done, the fries are done. I'm gonna take the chicken fingers out the oven and toss them in some buffalo sauce. And then it's time to eat. But I wanted you to look at this gorgeousness. Well, first of all, look how like golden brown I got it. Just, is that not sexy? Come on. And then look at that. Oh my god. It melts like real cheese, you guys. Go Dea. It's really hot. It's making my hands like, I'm trying to hold them with my fingernails. Oh yeah. Zoom in on that. Hello. Grilled cheese, buffalo chicken fingers, and french fries. A very not healthy dinner, but like I said earlier, today I wasn't feeling that good, so I just really wanted to just grease it out. <laughs> but I'll make up for it, you know. It's all about balance. I'm gonna make up for it like tomorrow. You can eat not healthy some days if you balance it out, you know. Just like I heard this saying, like, you can't gain weight from one bad meal and you can't lose weight from one good meal. It's about balance. So, yeah. I just wanted to say that. Um, and that's it for my What I Eat in a Day, you guys. Hope you enjoyed.